Finally, at this time, Special Advisor to the President on Media and Publicity, Femi Adishino, has advised clergymen in the country to emulate the General Superintendent of the Deeper Life Bible Church, Pastor William Kumuyi. The advisor described him as a man of wisdom. Senior correspondent Ivy Kanu has more. It's a program by the International Friendship League, an outreach arm of the Deeper Life Bible Church. It's about the book, Kumuyi, Defender of the Faith. Pastor Kumuyi does not engage in New Year prophecies or the political fortune telling or predicting who will win the next presidential election. Though that's why the gathered, the chairman of the occasion, spoke on the role of Christians as the country gears up for the 2023 general election. We cannot have a better approach than that exhibited by Pastor W.F. Kumuyi. His life shows that at a time like this, a time of social instability and intense political activities, believers, especially servants of God, must not plunge head on into partisan politics. They must not become doomsday prophets, nor should they take sides with any political coloration. Instead, children of God should maintain respectable neutrality and be seen always as dignified messengers of hope and verity. At a time like this when most pastors have gone very political, it's good to have somebody that stands out. That's how the media advisor to the president, Mr. Femi Adeshina, will rather start his speech. Then he delves into the reason for the event and the person of general superintendent of the Deeper Life Bible Church. When he speaks, we can listen, knowing that it is not tainted by prejudice, it is not tainted by politics, it is not tainted by any other consideration. Whatever he says, you can be sure is what the God of uh, what what the Word of God says. Wherever he stands is where the Word of God stands. It's very very rare to see and hear voices of moderation like that. The program is tagged "Reading from a Perspective Watchman," a prime chapter from the book "Kumuyi, Defender of the Faith," detailing the comportment and outlook of Christians and Christian leaders to prime issues of national development. Ivy Kano, CBC News, Lagos.